I keep telling you guys to watch for patterns. These are just holes in how YouTube conducts itself. It just cracks me up. I mean, YouTube still has fucking porn on here. And it's still fucking... And this is shasty as shit. You can still find underage porn and other shit like that. They cracked down. They used to really have a bunch of that shit out there. All kinds of fucked up crap. Point to that being uh, part of how they rolled... This is a shit presentation pardon me how our masters uh started making you jump through hoops and say this video is not made for kids this video is made for kids blah 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 so if you look on here i just uploaded something the one below it says never ending train of fuckery if you type the word fuck in the title section it will be flagged and it will automatically be lumped into one of those categories and i mean this is good i mean kids do have access to the internet unfortunately <laughs> So there's a lot of shit that they probably shouldn't see for the most part. And I, I frown on censorship, but I also frown on corrupting fucking children. Um, and or exploiting children having to do with the other stuff. And that stuff's on most of the social engineering platforms to varying degrees, but most people don't fucking realize it. It's a fucking issue, and it's also probably, I think it's intentionally out there, but maybe I'm wrong. Either way, um, so if you type the word fuckery... It will not fall into that category, which means it slips right under that little radar of the algorithm. The other aspect of this is, if I don't put fuck in the title, I can say fuck, 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 and talk about all kinds of fucking crazy shit that kids probably shouldn't fucking listen to, and shouldn't be privy to, and that doesn't fall into that category either, which could mean that YouTube hasn't spent the money and or... They don't have a sophisticated algorithm that's picking up on all of the words and whatnot. And yet, I really think it's where their time and resources are allocated. Medical misinformation, you know, shit that actually benefits the human body, is flagged. And anything that has to do with fucking COVID, <laughs> if you speak out against blatant agendas, it is flagged. Which means they do have that fucking software. Or however I should put it. Um, now just imagine if they applied that to removing all of the fucking child pornography and all the other fucking ridiculous shit that is still alive and well across these social media platforms. 